I hate cars. Where do I start? I was trapped within a box, no more than 15 feet across. In the front he sat, what was he doing? Gushing, spurting, spouting, spewing, just words. Just words that I know I've heard. Just words make me clench my fists. They greatly assist those carvings in my wrists. Insisting I should not think about that. Pardon, my thoughts are too fast. There in that box I sat with my dad. He said that I don't remember what he said. But I do remember that coffin of a bed and agonies of desolation in my head and every inch of sanity shred instead of what he said. It was concerning academics, I believe. But he can't see. Not the difficulty. I see, I touch, I feel, I breathe of violently pleading my own brain free from clouds of smoke and trying to be what they want me to be. Do you see? She never did. His words escaped his lips like puffs of smoke. And although my mind was somewhere remote, Constant thoughts linger in this box, and one by one, they were caught on the pan of my brain. And from there, I went insane. My head crashing, banging, slamming, bashing. Her voice, her vehement tongue and deadly poise had yet to feast on what was destroyed before what she could even start. Aimed at a jaded heart. I hate cars. And as he drabbled on, my weary mind began to slow. My head was hung low, slung up against the window as I waited to return home. <laughs>